My name is Danica McKellar, and I play Helen. My name is Cameron Matheson, and I play Henry Hart. Get it? Hart? Valentine's Day? Boom. Join us for a behind-the-scenes look at our new countdown to Valentine's Day movie. Helen loves flowers, so flowers is her business. The uh, left side's a little lopsided. Wait, my left or your left? <laughs> it's perfect. Did you come all the way across town just to tease me, Henry? Well, I wouldn't put it past me. You know, the two of them are friends, but probably if they were had a little more courage, they would have gotten together much sooner than they do in this story. <laughs> because for many years now, he hasn't sort of expressed his feelings uh, to Helen, his true feelings for her. Um, oh, man! What is taking well, so I know, long. she is! I, I can't understand. believe you heard this. I'm so embarrassed. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting for you to express your feelings. Well, you heard it. That's the only way you're going to hear him is off camera. Off camera, okay. <laughs> there she is. <gasps> oh, Helen. You'll be the belle of the ball. Listen, my character Henry works up the nerve to finally ask Helen to the masquerade ball, right? The gala is gorgeous, and my gown is just beautiful, enormous. It's a princess dress. It's a princess fairy tale come true. Tonight, you get to be anyone you want. But of course, at the masquerade ball, everybody's wearing masks, so Helen approaches this other guy who's tall and looks a little bit like Henry. So I go up to him and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I found you. And I'm talking a while in a minute. Turns out it's not Henry, it's someone else. And they uh, hit it off right away. She's kind of swept off her feet. And then suddenly he has to go. Much like a reverse Cinderella. I'm sorry, I have to go. Go. I mean, I didn't realize how late it was. Wait, but. It's a pleasure to meet you. Goodbye. I try to track him down. I can't track him down. I enlist Henry's help to help me find this masked man. Charles? Uh, no. Was it him? False alarm. <sighs> it's a very conflicting situation for Henry because, of course, he genuinely wants to help Helen out, but at the same time, he's helping her find the guy that's going to basically replace him in a relationship that he'd love to be in. And that's a beautiful thing. It's beautiful. Maybe a little dumb, but beautiful. And this is the perfect Valentine's Day movie. It's got some Cinderella, it's got some Cyrano de Bergerac, it's got unrequited love, and a huge, big Valentine's Gala. It's a masquerade ball. What's not to love? Very, very Valentine. Three, two, hey, everybody. You're supposed to say one. Oh. How did I know you? OK. In three, two, one, hey, everybody. Hi. Happy, th happy Thanksgiving. OK, here we go. In three, two, one, hey, hey. everybody. Hi. That was me first. <laughs> oh, my god. Three, two, one. Hey, everybody. We want to take this chance to wish you a very happy, happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day. Oh, my God, that was so good. That was, that was a good one. We did it. <laughs>